Hope you guys have been liking all of our content lately because we've been pulling mad triggers for all you guys what do you guys think about that those FRS headlights Ivan did a great job on installing that yesterday they came out super sick and Brian's RX-7 has been coming along just fine as well I wanted to show you guys what I got in today I'm fucking stoked about this too Woo! yup that NVIDIA exhaust came in, baby. I'm gonna install this today. I'm fucking pumped and I'm ready for that. However, we are gonna do that a little later because I got tons of emails and a lot of planning to do for our event coming up this year. Now that we're on that topic, it would mean the world to us if you guys would share the video that we posted about like three days ago of our event in March. That video, we put a lot of time into it. And just share it with all of your friends. Let people know about this event that we're having at the NOS Center. It's gonna be fucking sick. We're not gonna disappoint you guys. 350Z's coming along just fine. Those new headlights are so sick. I also wanted to talk to you guys about another thing. So as you know, we've been doing our podcast every other week and oh, I'm in the podcast room right now <laughs> it's weird if you guys want comment below and you know shoot suggestions on people that we should interview and have here at our podcast we're looking for people that are you know influencers and very inspirational just to get to know their car and the driver behind the car if you guys have any suggestions just comment below and we'll do our best to get in contact with those people. So we're gonna go ahead and install my new NVIDIA exhaust on the 350Z. Let's see how that goes. real quick I have the whole layout on the floor we have your mid pipe right here all the way to the connecting pieces to the dual mufflers and as you can see it's a pretty fucking badass exhaust it's all titanium it's pretty cool so the exhaust came with silencers and you know we're not gonna need these and did you have silencers you're a bitch all right, so let's get down to business and install this new exhaust right now. It's always the beginning, dude, that is like... It's hard. It's hard, it's always so rusted. We got a second bolt right here that we have to loose. So what I'm doing right now is I'm unscrewing the nuts from the cab back, and this is the mid pipe. Next up, you have to remove these two bolts that connect to the muffler. with the old and with the new as you guys know the muffler is attached by these two rubber hinges on both sides we just got done unscrewing them if you own a 350z it's gonna be right at the top you unscrew that and this just comes out I you know normally people would actually try to like take this out by trying to remove this rubber piece right here but you don't really need to do that you can just unscrew it I'm not a big guy like my boy Gio right here so I call them the big guns to help me loosen those rubber hinges as you can see my boy's doing work right now these hinges ain't no joke bro let's get it Gio show them how it's done baby get it get it there we go Woo! all the manpower you need fuck a tool bro get Gio 
fucking fingers hurt. What's up, Swift Daddy? What up, big dog? What's up, baby? <laughs> Frankie grew like four inches. He took his vitamins this morning. <laughs> Trying to catch up to you, bro. Nigga, I, you you are, bro. I am. I, I've seen that. Either you're getting shorter, or I'm getting taller. You're getting taller. What do you bro. guys think? What do you guys think? Nigga, Comment what? Comment below. You guys think I'm getting shorter or he's getting taller? How many grown ass men does it take to put an <laughs> <laughs> exhaust on? <laughs> Swift as a hell. No, I was just holding the tool. I was holding the tool. Martin, what's up, baby? Bro, you give me some. You got to get the fish on me. Where's the nuts? Nobody give me nuts? Alright, cool. You got your own nuts, dog. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> he, he said, You got your own nuts, dog. You didn't have any nuts. <laughs> oh. Damn, nigga, you nutless? <laughs> Ladies, you heard it first here on Tune in Tokyo TV. <laughs> that shit's screaming, pull me over, bro. The fist is motherfucker, dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, my shit. Geo said it looks pretty. <laughs> it's pretty. So right now Gio's trying to take, trying to position that rubber oh. hinge right there. And he's obviously the tallest one, the only one that can actually do this. I don't know what the hell I'd be doing without him right now. Right now Gio is placing the exhaust tip. Let's see if he's going to be able to fit that in. Swift, come on. Yeah. There, yeah. there we go. <laughs> we officially have the new exhaust placed on the car. Look at this beauty. So let's lower the car now, turn it on and see how it sounds. This is the moment of truth. I'm super fucking pumped up. Let's see how it sounds. Swift, if I blow smoke in your face, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll be damned. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Right. <laughs> That's not so much better. Oh, I love it. It's perfect. It's absolutely perfect. Nvidia, I love the exhaust. Why I decided to choose the NVIDIA M1 titanium exhaust is because it has a, a small, very subtle rumble type of sound. It's very consistent and it's not so screechy and raspy. I think it's like absolutely like the perfect balance between what I want. Not too loud and definitely not too silent. We finished installing his NVIDIA dual tip exhaust. Next up, I'm gonna go help, I'm gonna help our, my boy uh, Swift. He's gonna go ahead and install a actual working fourth brake light here on this 370. What's up guys, it's Swift here. As you can see, we made a little mess down there. Trying to get rid of this third slash fourth brake light, we damn near had to just fucking jam it out of there. So as me and Swift were removing this last bolt from this housing that we're gonna need to use to install the aftermarket uh, third brake light, this nut um, does not come off. Like when we were loosening it, it just broke. It snapped, I don't know why, but what I'm, in, what I'm doing right now, I'm using a Dremel to actually cut the bolt off so we can get this removed and install a new one. Right, guys so just a quick update on what we're doing right now we were able to get all the wires through the grommet Ivor right now is cutting through that there so we can go ahead and splice these wires to the tail light harness sorry if this video seems to be a rush it's time consuming right now it's pretty late we all want to go home but we definitely want to get this done So we're making progress. I'm pretty happy about it. As you, as you guys can see, with Ivan putting his magic touch into his wiring skills, you got the black to the black, green to the green, red to red. 
Um, this white wire here has been left alone because we're trying to figure out what this splices into. Uh, this is actually the reverse light. This green and white wire you guys are looking at right now is the connection for your reverse light. So that's what we're gonna splice the white wire into. There it is. That is a beauty right there. Woo wee! The littlest touches always make a big difference. It is amazing, I'm loving it, super happy. Can't thank Ivan enough for what he did. I'm gonna go ahead and pass it off to him. He's gonna catch me rolling out of here. So me and Swift, we're gonna call it a night. It's a long day. So today we installed Frankie's um, exhaust and then I go, went ahead and helped Swift install his uh, third brake light and that thing's badass. I did forget to announce yesterday's YouTube giveaway winner. YouTube's giveaway winner for your last video is, and then also for today's video, our YouTube giveaway winner is. So go ahead and make sure to go ahead and send us a DM or email us your address and shirt size and we'll get that package to you right away. Also guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please go ahead and make sure to like and subscribe, share our videos with all your friends and family. And until then guys, peace out. Everything I drop,